What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Super Cooper Sunday! Good boy, Coda. Do you want to squeak it again for us? Oh no, we're, we're going to do that? Okay, I'm not, I'm not really sure what's happening. Coop, what are you doing? Come here, buddy. Good boy, good boys. You're both good boys. Oh my goodness, actually today, we are gonna find out just how good they are. Today, we are gonna be doing the good boy challenge. And uh, this is something we've had on our idea list for a while now. I'm glad we're finally doing it. It's gonna be really interesting to see who listens, who follows and, and gives into peer pressure or doesn't and that sort of thing. So basically what we've got going on is we have their table set up right here and we've got three different types of treats. We've got a regular dry cookie. <laughs> well, that wasn't how that was supposed to go. A chicken nugget. And don't you think about it this time. We've got chicken nuggets. And last but not least, we have a fresh piece of steak, which I'm gonna be honest, I can smell this, like from here. Even even Bella can smell it. So this this is gonna be the, the final challenge. This is the last one, because it's definitely the most tantalizing. So the idea is we're gonna take the snack, put it on their plates, tell them to stay and leave it, and then we are going to walk right out of the house and we'll see how long it takes them to break or if they can listen. Now hold on, before we get to these crazy boys, there's something even more important we've got to mention. It's a special day. It's this one's gotcha day, I guess is what we're calling it. So we're recording this video a couple days before we post it, but exactly one year ago from today is when she was dropped off on our doorstep. On January 24th, she just totally left me right there. That makes me really sad. But January 24th, 2019. And uh, I mean, obviously we, we think her birthday was Maybe two months before that is when she was actually born because she was pretty little when she was dropped off. But uh, we don't know what it is, so we're going to celebrate the one thing we do know. So January 24th is your, your doorstep day, babe. That's what we're going to celebrate for the rest of your life. So unfortunately, we didn't realize this until it was a little bit too late. We want a little extra time to be able to plan a cool party and like put together some fun games and stuff. So you guys will see that next week, but we just wanted to give a special shout out to Bella. She's a sweetheart. She keeps these boys in line. And uh, I think we have a small gift, right? Yes. This is a pineapple filled with drugs. Cat drugs, that is. It's catnip, so there you go. Hopefully you like it. Like we said, next week we'll do kind of a big special birthday and have some cool things planned, but uh, you're a good girl. All right, boys, come on. Come here. Good boys. We're going to see how good you are today. Kobe, come over here. You can sit over on this side. Good. Nice job. Kota, sit. 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 Good boy. All right, you guys stay. Stay. No. <laughs> All right, so round one are gonna be the cookies. So they don't really smell like anything. I mean, they're desirable, but it's not a chicken nugget. It's not a piece of steak. So I'm hoping at least for this one, they'll stay. Yeah. I guess we'll see what happens. So here we go. Just put them down. Stay. Stay, stay boys. Stay, Coda. Stay. All right. So if we walk over the... Ah, ah, Coda, Coda, Coda. I know you've got a stronger willpower than that. Bella, no. <laughs> We'll come over to the other side of the room. They're not, they're not gonna take it. Stay. I can see the drool coming off of Koda from, from half the room away. And this is not the good treat. I'm gonna give it like 20 seconds. Let's not say anything and see if they break. Should we talk amongst ourselves? Yeah. Yes. We're just not, we're not nice paying attention thing. to them at all. They're both oh. staring at us. I can I can see it out of the corner of my eyes. They're both staring. I can I can smell the desperation coming off of Cooper right now for sure. Okay. There's... So they're they're being good. I don't think they would really do it while we're here in the room. But the real test comes when we go outside. They think we're gone. They think that we can't see or hear them. Let's see who's gonna break first. You ready, girl? Let's do it. All right. Here we go. We're going outside. Stay. All right. Going outside. Let's see, um, how long should we stay out here, do you think? How long is it gonna take? I mean, I'm pretty sure they're gonna break, they've already broke. You think so? Automatically, when we came up with the idea, I was like, oh, he's there. Do you think he ate it? I have no idea. They broke in like they're 10 seconds. They're both here now. 
Excuse me, what happened? Oh, both of the cookies are gone. Oh, God, look at the floor where Kona was sitting. <laughs> Ew. Oh, wow, look at, look at this down here. Just puddles, puddles of drool. And I just noticed somebody was licking the plate clean, huh? Interesting, all right, you know what? We're, we're just gonna keep on going. Maybe the second time will be better. So obviously we have no idea what happened because we did just leave the house, but at the end of this video, we're gonna go back, we're gonna review the footage, and we'll just kind of, you know, record our reactions and talk about it. Yeah. So let's go to round number two. One chicken nugget, stay, stay. Second chicken nugget. I don't know. I, to be honest, no. I kind of... <laughs> These are his weaknesses. <laughs> go to, go to, get back. <laughs> Kumi, get back. Both of you guys, get back. Look at this place. <laughs> <laughs> we back the table up and we're gonna try to get them to both lay down that way It's like a very clean whoever breaks breaks. It's not like oh I accidentally leaned too far forward and all of a sudden I've got a chicken nugget in my mouth He's tilting his head back and forth from nugget to nugget <laughs> Koda Are you gonna listen better this time? No, 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 no. that's not how you listen. No, no. No. Stay. You guys are good boys. I know you can make me proud. Stay. Stay. You better stay. Don't do it. Those naughty thoughts in your head. Don't do it. Koopy just has a naughty look on his face. Oh. Uh, one, two. He's here. <laughs> <laughs> and they're both gone. <laughs> you know, these boys really like this game. I've gotten up and eaten it and gotten to the door in the time that I said one, two. <laughs> We're gonna have to review the tape. All right, Chels, we're bringing out the big guns. You ready for this? Boys, go to bed. Go to bed. Go to bed. Pick, pick which one you want. Pick whichever one. You're gonna pick the old nasty one that we've had for years. I 100% trust in both of you guys right now. I don't really. That you're not gonna be naughty here, okay? You're gonna stay. You're gonna stay, all right? You're gonna be good boys. It smells really good. It really does. Like, I kinda wanna just bite off a piece of that. Stay. Look at them both watching. I think I should move. Move this camera right here. That's a good shot. So, we've got two pieces of steak. We've got two good boys over there. And we're gonna hope that they're actually gonna be good. We're leaving. We're off to the store. Hey. Who knows when we'll be back. You should probably be good though. You know, just, just be good. Hey. Good boys. Okay, Do you think they're gonna be good? Two. Should we wait until we see one of them come up? There's no way he got to the plate no, that fast. He didn't. I saw him come from the bed. Really? Oh. Is he not eating any of the snacks? Is he, is Koda still on the bed? Koda's eating snacks. No, he's not. Oh my god. No, he's not. Koda! I'm telling you, Koopy, I saw him. You could tell that he was like still in the process of standing up as he walked over. He didn't eat those snacks. I don't know if I believe it. I really, coming into this, I 100% thought that Koda was gonna be the one that either didn't eat or was like giving into peer pressure. He saw Cooper eating, so he would get up to eat. Come I didn't in. think he'd be the instigator. He is the one that no matter where we go, people are like, wow, your dog is so well behaved. Not him, him. This is my, okay, I'm gonna get the footage off the cameras. We'll see you guys in the office here in a second and we're gonna review the tape. Cooper, the truth is about to be revealed. Is there anything you wanna tell us beforehand? Cause this is a big <laughs> deal. This is, we're, we're learning who can be trusted and who can't. He's like, yeah, more cookies. <laughs> <laughs> this is a fun episode for them. Okay, so what we know so far is that definitely every time both treats were eaten, and we have a suspicion that Coda was the one that got both on the last yeah. one. Which is shocking to me, and honestly a little disappointing, because I was like, if Cooper does it, I'll be like, haha, that's Cooper, but Coda. Because he's always, like, Cooper always gets in trouble. He always just, like, he's the funny, crazy one. Coda's the one that usually listens a little bit better. He's like a perfect angel. He walks Marley. better on the leash. He's better around people, like, not getting in your face, like, he going crazy. He doesn't Like, when we eat dinner, Coda lays in the other room. Cooper's like, oh, hello, what are you, what's for dinner? Like, exactly. I'm so, shocked. So, uh. All right, let's let's just watch this this okay. first one here. This you ready for this? Okay. This is the very first one, the cookie. Hit play. So here we go. We're walking outside. Hi, buddy. That was like 
the same time. Yeah. They looked at each other. They were like, yeah, we know yeah, what's they- up. <laughs> and then they both went, oh, Bella's. What is that? <laughs> it's the she, she hopped up there. <laughs> She's a little bottom feeder. <laughs> Look at Cooper pretending to be a little angel over there looking for us. Yeah, just to... wagging his tail. Bella's acting like she didn't do anything. <laughs> oh my Where'd she goodness. Where did come from? I didn't even know she was in the room when we left. I didn't either. All right. So first one, both equally at fault. I mean, hold on. Let's, let's rewind this. We're going to watch this back here. They kind of both turned at the same time. I feel like Coda kind of looked over at Cooper and saw that Cooper was going for Coda, it. Yeah. Coda but I also almost didn't, but then he was like, "Nah, I am." They they both kind of turned at the same time. So I don't think that was explicitly <laughs> Cooper's fault, that was but I, I I think they were definitely both guilty there. Okay. Now we're going to move on to number 2. The chicken nugget. Let's see what happened. Oh, not a chance. <gasps> no. Oh! <laughs> He's so bad. Koopy came back and checked for the nugget and it was gone. <laughs> oh my god. Baby, he, he didn't even wait until we were out the door. He but, was up and moving towards the chicken nugget before the door even shut. But also, how sad is it that Cooper was like, no, come back. So if, if what we think is true, then then Coda got five treats in total today and Cooper only got one. One. Oh no. Okay, we, we gotta okay. we gotta load up load up round number three here. Alright, let's let's start this up. So here we are, we leave. Koopy doesn't like us leaving. Koopy looks Coda just immediately gets up. He checked! He checked! Gone. Sprints over, grabs one, grabs the other one. Oh, look at Coop in the back. No regard oh. for anybody else. Doesn't care that his brother didn't get treats. Doesn't care that we're out of the house. He just, all he wanted was that, that piece of steak. Oh, and there's Koopy looking for the steak again. <laughs> oh, Coop. Okay, we're, we can, do you have more steak? Yes. We're, we're going to go steak. make Cooper some steak. We need to go back out here and confront oh. these boys. This is outrageous. Coda. Where are you? Are you kidding me? You're just sitting over here like a proper little angel. You aren't fooling anybody. We caught you. We saw your true colors. How you really feel about us. Cooper was trying to go meet us outside. He was concerned we had left and all you cared about was the food? Really? Is that all we are to you? It's just givers of the, the treats and the snacks? Is that all we are? Oh my goodness, buddy. I mean, I still love you. I don't blame you. If you put me in the same situation, I think I would probably do the same thing. But oh my gosh, Koopy, come here. You're such a good boy. So Cooper's whole life, especially back when he was a puppy and I had him like puppy training classes and stuff like that, he was always so quick to learn because he was so food motivated. Even the, the like leader of the puppy training class said that he was more food motivated than pretty much any puppy she had ever seen. Like he's always loved food. He's always listened for food. He's always done anything for food. I can't believe that he would give up food to come look for us. What I can't believe is that he gave up the food, but also he's not food motivated. It's a complete 180 for both of them. I'm blown away. Coda, I'm like, I'm kind of sad, buddy. I'm kind of sad. You made me kind of sad today. No, so we're, we're going to give this no, last this last little piece of steak to Cooper. So Cooper got two treats today and Coda got five. I feel really, really bad, but honestly, that was, that was pretty fun. <laughs> Coda, hey, that was, that was the cat. That was, Coda, there's nobody outside. Well, anyway, this was honestly a lot of fun. Good stuff, girl. I, I mean, I love stuff like this where we do like the what do they do when they're home alone and like now this. Let us know what your reaction is down in the comments if you guys have any other ideas of how we can kind of test them like this and, and really truly kind of see what character is in that big <sighs> distrustful white body. You are just, you, you really made me sad today, Coda. But that's all right. We still love both you guys. So, yeah, let us know what you guys think. If you guys have any ideas, leave them down below. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already. And we are going to see you guys next Sunday. Peace out.